Eternal Reefs works with the Reef Ball Foundation as our not-for-profit strategic partner, and we work with Reef Innovations as our primary contractor for making our reef balls. Reef balls are used worldwide. There are more than 70 different countries, more than 4,500 different uh, projects, and there are probably more than 700,000 reef balls in the oceans today. They're used for everything from reestablishing uh, fishing and uh, fishery management. They're used for coral transplants and coral restoration programs. They're used for beach erosion, beach restoration programs. They're also used for mangrove redevelopment. So reef balls have got a wide range of applications and usage, and they actually work. They stay where they're supposed to stay, and they do what they're supposed to do. I wish I could take credit for the reef ball design. It was designed by a group of divers from the University of Georgia who were constantly diving on the same spots in the Keys and recognized the degradation of the reefs and simply decided to do something about it. The reef ball design is brilliant. It's hollow, it's round, it's vented. 80% of the weight is in the lower 40% of the reef ball itself. This makes them incredibly stable in the marine environment. We're never going to say that Mother Nature can't do something, but if Mother Nature moves one of the reef balls that we've properly placed, you have probably much more significant issues on land than you have in the ocean.